sweetie peaky. With a uh, with a my uh, with a, a fellow crew in a wing, um, learning the basics of uh, mining right now. Um, I just clicked on YouTube, Kel, and um, a live stream popped up, but unfortunately it's Obsidian Ant, it's not yours, so I think you've got a little bit of a way to go before you pop up as quickly as Obsidian Ant, but I'm going to search for you and find you and watch you. Please, Kiki. Right. Let's go in. Yeah, I'm looking... He's live right now. Yeah. Okay. Right. Um, I'm pulse. Freaky, yeah, freaky. I'll turn the yeah. sound off so there's no echo. Right. Um, Kelsa, yeah, I'm watching you as well. If you want to yeah. ask me anything, I can. Yeah, well, how about this boulder here? No, it's way too dense. It's too dark. Well, okay. There's no one near bright enough. Well, I don't know. Moving along. Oh, void opals. Got another one. Um, so... Try to kind of, when you do it, just try and look at as many asteroids as possible so you can see a lot of space above your head there. Just look down oh, a little I... bit. Okay. Just point your ship down a tad. Just point your ship down a tad, Kel. Look down a little bit. Every time you scan, try and get as many asteroids in the shot as possible. Oh, okay. scan! But keep scanning constantly. Just keep scanning. Well, you've looked up. No, no, no you've looked away now. You, you scanned and then you look down. Just let the scan finish. Uh, yeah. Keep doing that. Yeah. Just scan again. Just scan again. No, not that one. Just look up. Go up. Go up. Go up. Go up. Avoid it. You're gonna hit it. Go up. I'm going up, but no asteroids. Right. Just keep scanning. Fight that until something pop. Uh, no, don't look into space. There's nothing up there. No, no. Just go down. Come back down. Come back down. Come back down. What about that guy there? No. Okay. You, you, you just go. Look so you can see loads of asteroids. Scan there, there. No, it's not bright enough. Keep going. Just keep scanning. Oh, yeah. Keep on scanning. But that one to the right, just try that one. Put a prospector into that one on the right. It's not too bad, that one. I don't think it's enough, but give it a shot. I've got another Void Opals uh, asteroid here. Oh, nice. Found about 10 to, you know, to 10. Oh, lo lovely. Prospect Olympic engaged. Asteroid scan complete. Oh, it's well, it's rotating quite quick, that. Disable that one. Uh, cool. Right. So that is sub that subsurface uh, surface.
There's a little bit in the red here, so I'm going to risk it. It's only a tiny bit. I've got the green, I've got the blue tick. So... There's a tad, a tad in the red, but it's mainly it's the blue tick, so... Oh, totally missing that. No, Kel, it's that's white. You can't even see that. It's not even on the right side oh, of the no. asteroid. It's got to be blue. Yeah, I did have it in blue. But the asteroid moved around. Just let it come back around. You've got to get it dead on. You can't just like shoot it at a crazy angle. The one right in front of you there, what's that one? Click that. Yeah, yeah. I did have it clicked, but... Just click, but click one of the blue ones, so you can see it. Yeah, that, that was. Okay, uh, surface, yeah, you should be able to get that one. Yeah. So, Kel, um, just click on, just click it, see, it's activated. Yeah. Why is it white? I have no idea. That might be, how many metres is that away from you? Pretty close. How many metres is it, though? Uh, click, click it and then tell me how uh, many About tw 24. Th that should come straight off. Just click it again, so you can see it. You keep going round the side, you need to be in front of it. You can't get it from that angle. That might be bugged, that one. Leave that one and go to a different one. Because oh, yeah. it looks white even when you can see it. It looks still white, so it might be bugged. But you, you, you know, sometimes you, it looks like you're near them on an angle, but you have to kind of fly around the asteroid a little bit and get to, there'll be like a little nut, a little like nick um, sticking out or a little sort of angle you need to get around to. Right, yeah. It's a party. I've, I've done it, I've invited them. I've invited them. Well, I'm going to practice on this one. Shh. 
Hey, Bopper. Good evening, Bopper. Welcome to the live. Welcome to the live stream. You still got that cold of yours. Oh, good Hello. evening, Cox. Got a full pot. Got six, six elite dangerous. Have you, you click on the Prospect Olympic, Cal? You need to click on the Prospect Olympic. I'll tell you all of the stuff there. All right. So when okay. you find the Prospect Olympic, you're meant to click on it. Oh, so right. it tells you what it's found. Good idea. It's good for you. That will sort the uh, your sore throat. It'll, at least it will soothe it. Have you found the perspective, Kel? Uh, Is that triangle next to you? Go look right a little bit. It, on oh. you look on your radar. It's the triangle. It's the white triangle on your radar. Okay. I've got it. It's right a little bit more. Yeah. No, it's not that one. It's right a little bit more. There. Is it? Yeah. That's it. That's it. See, so can you tell that tells you everything? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So if there was, if it, if there were, if you could do deep fissure, it would tell you in that screen in blue at the bottom of the bo bottom left hand corner. Oh, it'd right. tell you at the bottom there. You could do it. That's that's square. Oh, I see. Yeah, the little red square at the bottom. But no, the little the the writing in the bottom left hand corner. Yeah, if, there, yeah. if you could do, if if there was something to, uh, if you could do deep mining in there, it would write in blue, deep mining, sort of void opals or whatever. Oh wow! Well, okay. Say there. Oh. That's why you meant to, you you not you have to click on the prospectus limpet really to sort of tell you properly dead quickly. You can go around clicking all of the separate things if you want, but it's a lot takes a lot longer. Ah oh, right. That makes it a bit easier. Right, we'll move on then. So you can go a lot faster, Kel. You should put up your en full pips on your engines. Oh, yeah. And you just go drive at full speed and just, just keep driving through the middle of the asteroid fields. Just scan, 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 scan. It's a lot quicker. Found a nice little spot bopper, um, just randomly. And Alex has been in, in with me. We've got quite a lot of void opals, haven't we, Alex? I don't know if he's got his mic on. I've got another one here. Let's have a look. All right. Yeah. Sorry. I'm just watching TV. I'm watching TV at the same time as playing. Oh. What's on TV? Uh, I'm watching Inside Number Nine, you know, the um, dark comedy thing. No. Yeah, yeah. I love League of Gentlemen as well. It was really funny. Same, same guys, but yeah, like. That's why I'm off mic. <laughs> Did you? Ah. 
it's proper funny. Yeah, the newer stuff's really good. Like, it's just, um... I don't know, it's thought-provoking. Yeah. Yeah. Can hear you, buddy. Anyway, I'm gonna get back off my... <laughs> <laughs> Speak to you a bit. Bye. Right. Righto. for a live stream. I just crashed into every single asteroid. Bargain. <laughs> Absolute bargain. Maybe he wanted to make sure he, uh, he's got a bit of a power source. Well, it's a no-brainer. It's a uh, it's a Fox Astra. <laughs> Just laughing because uh, Bop Bopper likes my my post my posh pronunciation of Sierra. <laughs> 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 a 
we're just sitting there. Yeah. Yeah, I love the tea. You'll have to bring it in Rachel's refreshments. Right in the distance. I come to you. Is that your uh, Land Rover, Samo? Oh, void opals, here we go. Right. Come on. I always do the detonate now, I can never be bothered waiting. It takes ages for them things to blow up. It's like two minutes or something, isn't it? I don't know, it takes 20 seconds to get them all on. Uh, how's the live stream doing? How are you I, doing there, Kel? I don't know how many people are on because I've got um, my headset, so I would have my laptop it's, with me. But... It's just me, Kel. It's just one. Oh, it's just one. Well, I, this, look, this looks a goodie. I like little nugget. Yeah, that's bright. That's one. That's one. That is one. First one I've, I've seen all day. That's a. That is a. Uh, that should be a. Uh, this year. This year. There should be this year on there. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, uh, yes. You sounded a bit like a bit French there. There's a few I'm just trying to mix it up. I, I don't want Bopper to be disappointed with me. <laughs> I want him to be hear proud. different. Right, you should get that perspective limpet in there. Off we go. Prospector limpet 
Well, there's no fishes there. No, you... oh, there's none. There isn't one. Okay, it wasn't right. bright enough. Right. Have to move on. You have to move on. Right, you know. On. Yep. That looked close, though. That yeah, was. Um, I, I was a little bit surprised actually. I thought that should. I thought that would be one. That looks pretty, pretty good. My next asteroid. Um, hot spots for me. There's one opal void one, but I am finding um, op uh, void opals in you know every two or three minutes. I find them very easily. I mean, Wu Yin effects. Who had who? Uh, who here had the Amiga? Five hundred, six hundred, twelve hundred, any of them? I was just watching some videos before about the best Amiga games of all time. I was seeing some classics on there, some brilliant games on there. Bopper would have definitely had one. Come on, Bopper. You'd have had one. Yeah, he had the five, six, and twelve. Yeah, I had that. Some great games. And the funny thing is, on one of the videos... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Bopper. But list out, reel off a few of your favourite games on the Amiga. I'll tell you if they were on the list. Cannon Fodder, yeah, that was on the list. That's in my top five. Project, I don't remember that. I've never heard of that one. Project X. I, th I think maybe that was in, but I, I don't know it. Well, with Amiga, everything were copied. Well, they were all copied games, weren't they? Probably Olympics, um, yeah, one of the, from, sorry, was that in 92? Was that 92? Um, but yeah, it wasn't my Amiga, it was my, it was my, it was my dad's basically, I just played on it, I didn't, I didn't even, I had no decision making in what to buy or anything, I didn't have a clue. Um, Chaos Engine, Bopper, Chaos Engine. Yeah, that's in my. That was my. I think one of the best games that was in the list. And the music's the best music on any game ever in Chaos Engine. Character selection music. I sometimes play that for you, Dan or H, just as a treat. <laughs> as soon as I play it, you, she goes. Um, you, you say, what do you always say? You say something engine, but it's not Chaos Engine. You always you can remember the word engine, but not Chaos. Bitmap Brothers, yeah. Um, Supercars was brilliant. Sensible Soccer, yeah, that's in the top five. That's that's one of the best ones. That's in my top few. Moonstone, do you remember Moonstone? No. Yeah, you do. You must do. Yeah, that's it. I can tell you that's a yes. <laughs> Uh, 
uh, Samo, what was your favourite games on that Amiga? Uh, I was uh, did uh, did you uh, have missile defence? Okay. Uh, another good. It's a game. Well, elite. The first elite tends to get high up the rankings as well. That first elite. Um, that. The first elite. Drone. Oh really? Hmm. Prospect Olympus engaged. Asteroid scan. What's the mission? What mission is that? Is it meant to be a contact to your meeting? You could try just jump going into um, jump into the next system and back again. It might trigger a AI character. Seismic charge is Asteroid scan. Yeah. You can't fix it. Complete. Asteroid scan. You can't repair it. Asteroid scan. 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 Go on your stream and say. Uh, yeah, that's got nothing in it. Right, right. Okay. There might be, well, th no, they, there could be fissures, it, but it's more that there's nothing deep, you can't deep mine anything out of it, is the point. Right. Okay. Should be a good one. Fuck's sake, I'm have to do a reboot and repair. Let's get this freaking thing back up. Programming limpet drone. God damn. That's really bright, that one, Kel. Yeah. That should be it. Just checking it out now. Yes. Asteroid scan complete. Yeah, so that's uh you can that's that bit in blue, that's what you can get. 
Right, okay. It's valuable stuff, that as well. It's not a Void Opal, but it's still valuable. Yeah. You know, there's a bug on this game. If you, um, if you uh, are around an asteroid and you um, just detonate and you blow it up, and either you blow it up or you don't, if you then self just um, reboot and repair, you shit, it all disappears. All the stuff disappears. It happened twice now, twice in a row. Both times I've done that, everything's disappeared. Uh, not this in my ship, but everything that was on the asteroid. It's like the asteroid gets wiped clean. Even though, you, you know, it's just like it resets it. It's like it re it's almost like it refreshes it or something. It's just annoying. Because you can find something good and then you can do everything. And then if you need to reboot and repair because your bloody seismic charge is malfunctioned, it takes everything away. It resets the asteroid and takes all the goodies away. Still malfunctioned. Stupid. Why my size of charge just been malfunctioned? Something just shot out. That wasn't a seismic charge, was it? Switch my reboot and repairing as I'm rebooting and repairing and miss our fires on my goddamn shit. Oh no! Ah, oh, missed it completely. Right, it works now. Have you? How are you doing, Kel, with that? Uh, you need to get. You need to put more into that because yeah, it's not. I know. Blue I yet. know. Yeah, I'm working on it. You better be quick because you got one minute uh, to do it now. Well, I haven't mastered it yet. Well, you just pick a blue thing. You, you just you flying past it. You flying past it. Yeah, because I need a fisher. No, but that was you. You didn't click on it. You didn't even look. Oh, Jesus hell. Just to your left, right there, right above your head, right above your head. Just to your left. Look, no, you're going past it again. Don't, don't fly to the asteroid. Just look, look up and down so you can see a blue thing. Yeah. And then click on it, and then if it's a fissure, go to yeah. it. Right, click on them three blue, there's three blue dots, right? Yeah, yeah, four, yeah. there's four of them. Right, just back off, you're gonna get blown up. Black, back off, back off, back off, back off. Put your systems on full pips. Put your systems on full pips. Get your shields oh, on. Get your on, shields. Yeah. Go backwards, 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 backwards. No, you don't go forwards, you're going forwards. Yeah. You're gonna get blown up there. Oh, I'm, I'm just really surprised you didn't get blown up then. I was only, I was only, uh, only had one on there. Oh, I guess you didn't blow it up properly, did it? Anyway, yeah, no. if that, if you had had all the, uh, that, if you'd had enough in there to put asteroid up, you'd have died then. That blue. Another bright one. Oh, 
Oh, it bounced off. No, that's white. You can't shoot that. It's on the other side of the asteroid. It's got to be blue. Yeah, that was blue there. No, no, the one you're looking at, that's white. That's white. It's on the opposite side of the asteroid. Now it, now it's blue. Click on it now. Now, now click on it. Yeah. You well, got No, you, you're on the wrong angle. You have to go round and look at it in front of it. You're on the side of it there. That should be all right, shouldn't it? No, no, no. It's nowhere near. You can't do it like that. You've got to follow it round. Use your side thruster. Use your side thruster. Yeah. Just, just use, use, side, use your thrusters to go around the asteroid. Right, go. just pick a different one. Pick a different one. Pick that one. That's the no. one. Next. Right, shoot in there. Shoot in there. Oh. It, it's going around. You have, you have to follow it around. You have to use your thrusters to follow it around. Right, you've now got 20 seconds to get there. In fact, you don't need to do anything. It's on blue already, Kel. All right. The tick's on blue. Back off, back off, and put your systems on full pot. Pips. Go backwards, go backwards, go backwards, yeah. go backwards. Just just go backwards, reverse. Yeah. You are quite close to that. Just, it'll hit you that, but you shouldn't die. Right. That's it. Go forwards, get it. Go and get your collector limpets out. I should be seeing something in contacts, will I? Yep, so some you'll have some contacts and then some you'll use your abrasion blaster to get the last bits off. Um, no, I'm alright now, Bopper. I fixed it. But if you want to come to where I am anyway, it's really, it's really good here for mining, where I am. It's another shiny bright one there. I love that. Could be another. That looks good. Well, anyway, Kel, that's how you you know how to do it. Anyway. Yeah. It's just a case of practicing. Yeah, I've got to practice now. So, well. so you got to shoot this. Well, you, now with your abrasion blast, you have to practice shooting things that wait until the, you know, things blue rather than. Yeah. Oh my God! How's that? Then white. Just practice now. Thought that'd be an opal, void opals. Cycle past it. Collection limpets. Programming limpet drone. Collector limpet expired. What time? What time? 
What time is it? Nine o'clock. Oh. Programming limpet drone. Oh, like, yeah. Limpet drone error. Deploy cargo hatch. No, no, it's comply. absolutely not. Yeah, oh yeah, it's, it's all about that now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Absolute all, uh, yeah, you're absolute all heart, you are. I'm kidding. and saying good morning
fucking Bromelite again. We've had Bromelite three times now. Yeah, and um, it's pub, it's pub, uh, and it and it was probably it was probably yours. Sometimes the seismic charger bugs out and instead of shooting forward it spirals off behind you. I had it when I first turned the game on this morning and it's been alright all day now it's doing it again. Guys, yeah. What is what's the rank after Tycoon for trade? Is it okay? Mate, eighty percent on Tycoon. Fucking hell. Yeah, maybe we should slow down. <laughs> Yeah, that, I think that was that's the one before Tycoon, isn't it? I think. Right. I think one more trip and I can get to Elite. What what happens? If, what do you get? Pride. No. Lots of pride. And a lot. Sorry. And a lot of a lot of respect. <laughs> Where's that?
Are you guys. Oh, I'll see you later. Right, in bed. See you then. Yeah, I'm mining where you guys are at the moment. Are you guys still here? Like in this yeah, area? Yeah, I, 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 I am. I am. Yeah. Uh, can you invite me to the wing again? Because oh, I'd like to I leave. Can. Right, right. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Oh, there's loads of people online. Christ. Where are we? Invite to wing. And he was just still there. Is anyone looking to get into the wing? Where's Cox? Is Cox in the wing already? No. I am. Alex, you've got no shields or health on my screen, Alex. Really? I've got full yeah. shields. That's weird. I've got 100% and... Oh, that's, that is strange. And now you've just speed out the wing. On mine. Oh no. Oh no, please don't tell me it's going to kick me from the server. Mind me, Void Opals. Oh, that's usually a bad sign if it's doing that. Should we start a new wing? Uh, oh, I'll just uh, invite you to this. Yeah, just, um. Yeah, invite you to this wing. Right, there's a Hang bright on. one now. Wing. This should be one. We're not showing coxes online, hang on. It's only showing you two are in it. Is Cox and Sammo gone? Uh, Samuel's gone. Samuel's Bob gone. Cox on mine. Sorry, he was in the party a minute ago. He was. He just left. Oh. Right. I want to get to elite today. In in which one? In which uh... trade? Oh, mate, oh, mate, I'm twenty percent off. On, on trade. That should be like one, one trip, I think. Um, what, what rank are you? Tycoon. Yeah, I'm a tycoon, but I'm only seven percent in. How can you have more trade than me? Because you've been doing it. <laughs> well, it's probably it's the money, isn't it? I think. Oh, you've been hammering trade, just doing loads of trade admissions. No, it's um, it's how much you sell. So oh yeah, mining yeah. Is... Oh yeah, that'll help. So the yeah. So I think it's based on how much you sell and buy. And I've done almost a billion in trade. Yeah, literally just mining. Um... Oh, mega game bopper. Uh, Rick Dangerous. Remember that one? What's that? <laughs> it's an Amiga game, Rick Dangerous. It's like a, it's a really good one. He must remember. Popper, Rick Dangerous. Look at my other ranks in this. I just sent. I sent a picture. Uh, it was um, uh, not 
quite like James Pond. I had James Pond as well. That was funny. What, James Pond? Yeah, it's like James Pond, but it was a fish. <laughs> <laughs> My wife's laughing at that. It's a, it was an Amiga game. It was like James Bond, but you're running around with a tuxedo one, but you was a red fish. That was oh, I remember that. Do you remember? Did you? I've well, heard of it. Sure. I mean, I doubt anyone's live streaming James Pond right now, but there might be a clip on YouTube. Oh, uh, really? It, it could well, well be, be a clip. Well, you got to get your combat up, Alex. Yeah, I can do the combat, but I just... I mean, me and Cox were there, like, at a nav beacon, just shooting things. It's, I'm just going to have to kill lots of ships. It'd take a long time to get up to Elite, to be honest, things like that. Yeah, I'm... trade, it seems to be the easiest one. Well, because of the value of it, yeah. Because it's mining now, definitely. Asteroid scan complete. I feel a bit bad if I reach it before Samo. Because he's not. <laughs> I think I overtook him. But he was the one who convinced me to do mining. So, uh, it's his fault. Was, yeah, so it's all his fault, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're the one who suggested it, so I went and done it. And yeah. now, now this is the result <laughs> of oh. my hard toil. Yeah. So I've got an insane amount of money, but not much else. <laughs> <laughs> At least you're rich. Yeah. Well, my, mining, I just, yeah, it's like... Yeah, I got the hang of it quite quickly. Yeah, well, I'm, you know, I'm getting there. I think I've had about ten trips so far. The mining. When did all this mining stuff come out then? Chapter 4, about December. Oh, okay. I mean, you had just a simple mining lasers before, you didn't have any of this. No, you didn't, have, didn't have it, uh, all the rest of this stuff. Right, okay, it's so a big update, to Chapter 4. I mean... The exploration's way better and the mining's way better. Like, they've literally taken two parts of the game and completely um, improved them massively. Yeah. What mining was? Yeah. Okay. At the moment it's like, <coughs> in two hours you can make 200 million. It's basically 100 million hour. Wow. Well, yeah. I, I don't think I don't think I would, I don't think I would get in that with my mining. <laughs> if I mean if you, I started off pretty slow. Like when Co when I first met, well Cox, Cox can tell you how bad I was. <laughs> I didn't know my arse from my elbow, and it didn't take me that that long. Oh yeah, mining-wise, I'm, I'm pretty much on top of it, but everything else in this game is still pretty new. New app. And I, I have not used the subsurface missiles at all. No, I haven't, actually. I mean, how did you pick... Did you how did you pick it up so quickly? Did you watch um, Freaky Geeky livestream? Uh, Boffer <laughs> gave me 15 million. Uh, uh, that helped out a great oh. deal. 
<laughs> so Bo Bopper gave me a head start. He, I so I bought a Cobra. Um. So yeah, I started off with a Cobra basically, Cobra Mark Three, and then yeah, and then just watched a couple of videos on YouTube. Yeah, well, no, I was watching, um, what's your, what's that DJ you watch? Obsidian Ant. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's the one. And the, there's like a Swedish guy or whatever. Well, there's two main guys I watch, Obsidian Ant and uh, Freaky Geeky. I'm, I'm, okay. I'm watching one of them now. Yeah. And it's you, Kel. Yeah, Just three watching me. you now. Yeah. Oh, oh God, Roti Dog's, Roti Dog's watching you. Yeah. Um. Yeah, me, me, Cox, and Rota Dog. It's Pam the Dog and all that. <laughs> yeah, just spam the chat. I can't see the chat anyway. <laughs> you're, you're not on Discord? Uh, Say hello to Rota Dog. Uh, good evening, Rota Dog. How are you, buddy? How you been doing? Ah, oh, okay. Asteroid scan complete. As um, Roti Dog, have you got the uh, mine? Have you done much mining but since the new chapters come out? Well, I've got to go and get some more. Um, Is he there? He might not be there anymore. I don't. Know. Ask him it well. Put it in the message. I don't know if you can hear me. I'll sort of um, find. I'll type it in case he can't hear me. Mind. Well, I need some more limpet mines. Uh. Mm. Oh yeah, I've done stuff like I've gone like two and two or three hundred light years out without limpet mines, without without <laughs> yeah. limpet drones. That, that no, is, that is uh, <laughs> annoying. Like, I think I went sixteen jumps outside the bubble or something stupid, like sixteen or twenty, and I had to go all the way back. <laughs> yeah, that is annoying. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to um, at least um, bookmark here. A real lack of uh, asteroids, but decent ones. Yeah, I've been um, scouring about a decent asteroid. Mm. But also, yeah, I can't seem to find them either. Yeah, also, to, you know, I've only just started learning this this new way of mining, or, you know, the update, so... Yeah. Do you reckon they'll nerf it? Yeah. I mean, they must, I mean if, it's, if, it, if it's that big of a change from the norm, then... Yeah. Then again, it's unfair to people who haven't been doing it. Well, that's not... I don't think that'll ever come into it. OK. Fine.
let's go get some limpid mines. Do you believe the football score today? City 6, Chelsea now. Now, uh, where's my D scanner gone? See, Alex doesn't. Alex isn't showing up. Is in my wing, but he's in your wing, Kel. Oh, yeah, he's. How is strange. He, yeah, why? Why is he not showing up on your cockpit either? I don't know. That's really weird. Yeah, it's just me and Kel in this in the wing. I can't see anyone well, else. Well, Kel's in my wing as well. Right, so I'm gonna leave. I'll leave this wing, and then can you? I don't know what the fuck's happened. Okay. I just sent you a wing back right just now. You said I've got none. Okay, how do I leave the wing? Uh, social. Okay. Oh. Right, I do believe I've got the D scanner, discovery scanner. Oh, I haven't even got that on. Options, leave wing, there you go. Can you invite me to the wing, please? Right out. Yeah, Co cocks of anyone, I don't mind. Send you an invite. Huh? Wing invitation received, there we go. I'll accept that one. I'm still leaving the lot, the other wing. It's weird, it's not letting me leave. Okay. Now oh, you're in there. There we go. <coughs> you're in now, yeah. Yeah, I think I've got to sell another 200 million before I get to Elite. Maybe more, I don't know. <laughs> this one looks right. bright. The future looks bright.
Yeah, I'm surprised this this area is so good, so close to um, so because it's inside the bubble. Mm. It's not normally this good. Fuel scoop disengaged. Well, I might as well go to hiking clearly to pick up some more limpets. <laughs> You guys still mining? Yep. Cool. Yeah, still hard at it. Oh yeah, Bopper, do you remember the game Stunt Car Race on the Amiga? Have you bought an Amiga then? Or is it just one you used to own? Oh no, I just used to have one. Uh, yeah. It's just because I watched a couple of videos about like really good Amiga games. So Yeah, I kind of want to get like, um, like you know, they've been releasing all these new, like revamped versions. Nice. A lot of them games on the Amiga are better <laughs> than a lot of the games out now. Just, yeah. they're just that make way better playability, and there's like more to them. So you don't, you, don't, you can actually get them and play them now, and actually be still good. Hmm. Yeah, I mean. Like, there's, there's some games back then which I can still play now and still find fun. Yeah, I'll check out the Amiga games because I, I never had one and... Yeah, it'd be good to see what it was like.
they're hard as well, they're proper hard. Oh yeah, back then there was no um there's no way of updating games or DLC, so they had to uh, make the games really hard. <laughs> and there's no instructions either, it's like you walk to the end of a, a thing and there's a brick wall in front of you and there's no way past it and that's it. Mm. Uh, you have to work it out yourself. Yeah. Oh yeah, with, even with games like Final Fantasy I used to get stuck on levels because there was like a bit of the map which I didn't notice you could walk through. So I was yeah. like trying to find my way around it and like, oh. Remember being there for hours. Yeah, The Settlers was the guy's number one game, uh, Bopper. I'd never played it myself. Did you Did you hear me before? Did you remember Stunt Car Racer? Did you have that one? Someone's interdicting me. I oh, know. Stunt Car Racer? No. Oh, no, no, no. Stunt Car Racer was amazing. Um, sin yeah, they went on about Syndicate as well. Not, not, not about Flash, not sure about Flashback. What's that settlers? It just looks like it's like civilization. Yeah, it's like a sort of thing. Uh, uh, I never played it, but what Age of Empires? <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Just like that. Hmm. Um, oh, Amiga eight just spelled with an A. Okay, I've yeah. heard of that. It Okay, so this it was the same it was the same as the Sega Mega Drive that era. No, it was before. Oh before, okay. Sega Mega Drive's okay. gotta be what, nineteen ninety five or something like that? Ninety four ninety five, something like that, onward. Amiga I mean, would have still had stuff. Amiga would have still had stuff when that came out, but Amiga was like eighties and then through to the nineties, whereas Sega Mega Drive would have come out like five years later, but they would have had a smoke lap as well. Uh, it's 9888. But yeah, oh, hang on. Oh no, 1919 Europe. Okay. Oh, Sega Genesis. Same same thing as the Mega Drive. Hmm. Yeah, I mainly used to play N64 and PlayStation. <laughs> So what was your last console before you had that big gap of not gaming? Uh, PS2. Oh wow, so you, so you went from PS2 to PS4? Yeah. Um, yeah, that is quite a big, it's fairly so big jump. PS2 when I went to uni to get a PC to suck, like, write essays on. <laughs> and then, yeah. uh, and then 15, well about 12, 13 years later I bought a PS4. 
Probably about three or four years now. So I've... So I've only had a PS4 for... I think a year and a half now? But before that I, had, I used to have a PS3 but that was like... Yeah, there's a big difference. <laughs> well, PS5 will probably come out next year. Yeah. Yeah. Are you gonna get it immediately, or are you oh. gonna wait? Oh, I'd get it straight away if the PS5 came out. Absolutely. Hmm. And I'll probably have to wait about set as well. <laughs> oh yeah, they make you... all the controllers non-cross cross compatible. Yeah. Of course they will. Yeah, that fucked me off. <laughs> yeah, I always manage to break controllers. Not not like because I'm throwing them around, but like the, the, the analog sticks just die. All the all the vibration thing stops. Yeah, they're usually the first things to go. Hmm. But you can you can actually buy. You can buy them, actually replace them. Just oh, the parts? It, yeah. You can uh, unsolder yeah. it and solder up uh, new analog um, switches. Oh, I've tried I've tried to... I mean, what I used to do, I used to cannibalise the other controllers, like to make one working one. Yeah. <laughs> and I used to lose all the bits and, yeah, it's just... It gets messy. Gets messy real quickly. <laughs> mm. Kel, do you have anything in your inventory that you're selling now when you go back to that station? Or did you not ask uh, anything? Yeah. Um, what I got in my cargo is. Did you manage to mine enough to get anything to sell? Uh, I. I shouldn't tell you. <coughs> so we're going the wrong way. Yeah, I got uh not much really. I wonder what I, what I do have can sell. Here, if I can. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Thinning out a bit, Alex. Uh, hmm? It's thinning out a bit with the older asteroid here. It's not finding yeah. as much now. I'm I'm trying to go in a different direction each time. Which way? Which way did he go from <coughs> the um, hotspot? I always go towards the planet, that big planet. Just so I know my reference, bearing my reference. I might be near you. Put your beacon on. Uh, See where you are. Huh? Yep, it's on. Okay, hang on. Because I've gone towards the planet as well. Funny if I'm not next to you. Um, I can't see you. I can see the blue thing on the radar. Stop me to spin round. You should be behind. I know oh, you're ahead. Of, you're ahead of me. Yeah, I'm ahead of you definitely. Um, Are you you're. All... Oh, you're 323 kilometres behind me. Yeah. yeah, it's quite so, funny, I'm directly... <laughs> yeah, the bad news is for you, Alex, is that I've covered that 323 kilometres, so... <laughs> you're going to have to sleep on the phone. I'll have missed one, one or two rocks here or there. Yeah, I found, <laughs> I found a couple. <laughs> okay, so it's probably best I veer a bit to the left. <laughs> Not... I'm, I'm basically... Directly behind you, like in a line. 
Okay, let's go. I'm gonna go to the. I'm going to the left a little bit. I'm sure we wouldn't have gone exactly the same line either. No, no, we wouldn't be covering that anywhere near the same because even even a slight, even a slight different um, angle, and it's all completely different rocks. Yeah. The scale of this is insane. Yeah, I mean, I'm finding a few. I've got like 30, 38 or something void opals. I didn't think I had oh, much on this trip, but I've got 72, so. Oh, that's, yeah, that's a lot. Bad. I've got 72, and I got Alexandrite 29, Grand Diorite, whatever that is, 15. Nice. Now, this is a bright one. Come on. I want, give me something. Give me something. Yeah, it's I mean, my new goal hard. is not money, it's to get to the um, elite level. I just need to make, I need to basically get enough, enough money to be able to get there. Ah, nothing again. How, how far are you off it? Um... I'm tycoon, but I'm only about eight eight percent. I think it was or something. It was just into. Okay. But but then that was odd because I never got the award recently when I just sold shitload of stuff just now, like mm. you know, one hundred fifty millions worth just before. It didn't put me over to tycoon. So like, this is bright. I want results here. Come on. I've been doing trade missions, though as well. Well, I've done loads of trade missions when I ground up to my fed. Oh fuck, it's not enough. Um, when I got my federal, when I got my really high rankings in the navy, uh, federal navy, and all that. The um, alliance and stuff. Yeah, to grind up the trade to get to them. So I've had to try do that, and then I've been doing so this mining. It must literally be the money. Yeah, because they were just minor jobs. But I, I, to be honest, I was just going for reputation scores on them. Yeah. So that probably didn't do much for me. Yeah, because I think you have to sell a billion to get the elite rank. I think that's how it calculates it. What ship should I buy next? Like, because I'm not, I'm not high enough rank with um, the Federation or anything. Should I grind what, that next? What, what ships? I, I would personally. That was my first priority to get the Corvette. Yeah, I really want the Corvette, and I've, so I've got the Cutter as well. I've got both, although um, it's a hotly disputed fact. Uh, M doesn't believe me. I've got a cut. Because <laughs> I was like a, quite a low rank, and then suddenly I had it. Um, Have you put a lot into it? I just spent like three days, just completely getting it, like grinding it. Um, yeah. But she, she she didn't think it was possible, so she didn't believe me. <laughs> What M said that? Yeah, yeah. Ah, <laughs> she was kind of joking. Did, so, did you play with her before? Before she joined? So, so that she's part of your group? No, 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 no. I met her on, on this in this group. Oh, okay. It's like a I, couple of months ago. Okay, because I thought like, because you, I thought you all joined as a group or something. No, that was me, Kel, Jen. Ah. Um, Jen's not well. Jen, I speak to him every so often. He's, it's because you know this game's like when you put it down for a while, it's hard to pick up because you have to remember all the buttons and shit like that. He's he's kind of in that mode. Oh yeah, he'll, I, he'll come back on at some point. <laughs> I programmed some buttons a few days ago and I've completely forgotten what I programmed. 
which is like my heat sink and stuff. Which is probably not good, but oh well. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I got this game because I was playing Red Dead and I was playing it alone. <laughs> I was like, yeah, like, because uh, cause there's been no updates, like, yeah, it didn't make sense to play it. I only I only did the first three or four chapters on Red Dead and I stopped. I will pick it up and just play it every so often, just from time to time. But it just didn't. Mm. It was funny because there was no part of the game that I, I would say was bad. So like there was good graphics, good story, good playability. Like everything was good, but for some reason it just didn't matter. I just wasn't that into it, even though everything was good. It's quite odd, but. It's good, there's just no content on it at the moment. Basically. Oh, nothing again. I might have gone to Super Cruise and back in because I've found nothing now for ages. I was finding loads of stuff before, now nothing. Hmm. Do you know what? I've flown so far doing this, I might have even gone out of the hot zone. Um, I don't know. Well, I think I think the hot zone is actually millions of miles. I don't think it's actually... Um, I don't think it's that small. Maybe there's a red hot zone and a lukewarm zone. Oh no, we've run out of fishes. What happens if there's no fishes left on the thing? Then you can't do anything. Is that it? Oh, oh no. no. Well, you know, Swift is uh, it's taking all, all all what's worth in that in that asteroid belt. Yeah. Right, just check. I've got everything. Have you stocked up with everything? Yes. Right, that one's brighter. Okay, come on. Just give me something. That one's this this has got to be it. This has got to be it. This is this is the one on the money, yes? This is it. Rach, this is it. This has got to have it. This has got to have uh Void Opal's in. The limpet's going out. I can see fissures from here, so there's got something. It's just a question of what. Yes! Oh. That was like a 50-50 until I used my Jedi powers and it nudged up to 75-20. And that's, you know, they're the results. <laughs> right, here we go. Really? Coming back to mine some more. Right, that's done. You have been disengaged from the dock. Depart when ready. 
ready. Yeah, I mean, mining is is more and um, more uh, immersive in the uh, 4.9. Oh, it smells better. It's just Could astronomically get... better. You do have to get uh, oh. used to it all. Bopper must. I think Bopper loved the joke, and he's gonna type something like. Oh. Yes, with that. That's just what I want to hear. He said I was spot on, he couldn't have put it better he couldn't have put it better himself. Guys, put your um, beacon on for us. Yeah, I'll do it. Oh, thanks, mate. Well, it's already on, to be honest. Oh, why is it? <clears throat> Blue square. I, do, I was saying before, um, Cox, and I, I like um, the little detail of when you blow an asteroid up and you've got all the dust. Then when you do yeah. your pulse scanner, it like is a different color and everything looks different. It's all more grainy because you're kind of in the dust and all that. It's just gonna quite just the little details like that are quite good. I like the uh, the effect when it blows up. And you, can... you have to use your pulse scanner just to get out of there safely. Because you can't see the asteroids in the thick of the dust cloud. I do like the effect you can hear the dust hitting your ship as well while you while you're mining the 
the asteroid that you blew up. Alex, I think you was right though. The the more valuable ones do tend to be kind of on the edges of the asteroids for some reason. I've noticed, like in in the asteroid belt, like if you go to like fly down the edge, it seems to seem more on that edge. Is that, is that you, Swift? Detonation in 10 seconds? No, that must be Alex. Okay, this one looks bright. Not massively bright, but it could be. It's a maybe. It's just a maybe. It's a maybe, baby. Prospect 
No. Hmm. It's definitely thinned out a bit. Ooh, that's a bright one. That's got to be. That's got to be. Be disappointed if this isn't one. See the fishes from. Oh, no fishes on this one. Many high strength ones. Get it up. Prospect Olympic engaged. Now it's slightly in the red. Asteroid scan complete. Oh, 
this one. It's nice and bright. How's the mining going, Alex? Is Bopper still on the game? Uh, I don't know. Ooh, he's changed the game to Battlefield 5. Oh. There was only four of us. It's an even number now. That's bright, kill that one. Yeah. I'm hoping it's a goodie. That that's bright, that should be something. Get a little bit closer before we release the prospect of mine. Limpid, I mean. No fishes. Asteroid scan complete.
looks a bit dark, really. Gotta give it a look. I'm running out of perspective on this, so I've gotta be a little bit more careful now. Uh, anything that was even half a chance I was shooting at before, but now I'm actually just I saved him a little bit more. I've only got twenty left. <laughs> Come on, let's have it this time. Nope. Quite bright. Let's see. Programming the drone. Bright enough. Oh yes. Olympic engaged. Asteroid scan complete. Actually, I think it might. For be. sure, lovely. Actually, there's three or three of them are really bright. There's three in a row that are really bright. I'm gonna try them. Oh, no, no. They're all too they're all too similar. They all look bright though, that's the thing. Yeah, oh, it's Bromelite. Fuck, it is, it is Bromelite. It's just Bromelite. Okay. 
gives me a chance. Uh, gives me a chance for these two then. They're both bright. Detonation sequence initiated. Near the three, come on, this one. No. Okay. That is bright, that one, that is bright. That's got some. Really bright, that's got to be. Yeah, that is got to be. Okay. What you what you could mine out of that one, Kel? What's in there? Yeah, be allowed yeah. to buy, be allowed to buy a way set. Everybody uh, loves to attack me for. Okay, I've got Alexandra. I'll just get it. It's worth. It. It's fine. Do it. Do it. Still valuable. I mean, it's not as good as. It's still worth. It. It's still. To get into the blue. Detonation sequence initiated. So I'm way hard to waste loads of seismic charges.
Sorry, I think the mic was on mute. It is. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, is the Cut and Corvette the only two that you need a rank high high rank of that federation with the faction for? I think so. Yeah. So you can get the Beluga and the other ones. Yeah. Okay. I don't get the whole collect to link the expiring thing. Like sometimes they expire almost like immediately, and, I, and, it's, and I'm not clicking on something to collect it specifically. So I'm not it again. I, I know it does that, but if you click on something, it collects that and then expires. I know that, but so I'm not doing that. I'm just sending them out, and sometimes they only last like half the time as well. Oh, I, I think it's sometimes like. If you crash it in, if you crash into them, then into them yourself, or if you have like a rock below the cargo hatch, then they tend to crash into stuff. Like when I'm parked on top of an asteroid and I, yeah, and I um, get any collected them, but it just crashes into the rock. I've also had it where it's crashed into my own ship, like it's crashed into the windscreen. Come out with any goodies. What the fuck is hitting my ship? I'm not touching anything. I'm nowhere near that asteroid. Oh, you're getting some damage there as well. It's just, cause sometimes you just, it's just going bang, bang, bang. And like, there's nothing near you. Could be the limpets. Hmm? It could be the limpets crashing into you. That one's just expired. What other ships do you have? Me? Yeah. Um, I've got a Cutter and a Corvette, um, a Python, an Asp Explorer, a little Viper 3, um, and I've got a little adder. Have you, have you tried mining in the Cutter? No, um, I think I took it out once, but it's like, I don't like, I, I, I it's not. I'd rather have a more nimble ship to fly around the asteroid. Okay. Yeah, the Anaconda is like trying to drive a bus. It's difficult. Well, the cutter's a lot worse than that Anaconda. Is it? No, it oh, okay. It looks more nimble though. Like, it looks like it's a nicer looking ship. Yeah, it looks nice. It's not. It doesn't. It's not really good maneuverability. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, Clipper might be decent. Hmm. I think the Python's the best one, to be honest. Right, I used to have the jump range. I mean, I used to have low. like 30 lances and stuff like that, but I sold them when I got. Alright, guys, I'm gonna have to shoot off. It must be getting late right now. What time is it? <laughs> Alright then guys, I'm going to catch you hopefully tomorrow. In a bit. Yeah man. I'll be on. Alright. Yeah, it's good finally playing with you guys, like... Well, you, I seem to miss you all the time. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, we are in the same time zone. We should be able to uh, catch up with each other. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. Night at all. Night.